we are traveling tomorrow yay <laughs> so you guys today is the last day before our trip and today is the only free day i have had since i actually came back from canada today is the only day that i don't have anything major to do i still have one or two things to do but nothing major so yeah that's why i look a little bit crusty and dusty because i'm not trying to do anything much i'm even just i just want to lie down and sleep and just lazy around but i decided to do some last minute checking and packing and that is why i want to film this video okay i want to show you guys what i'm going to be carrying in my hand luggage at least the hand luggage for me and my kids what we're going to be carrying as hand luggage and what i am going to be carrying inside the hand luggage to basically help us with the journey okay because our journey is going to be 21 hours at least 21 hours that's the transit Time. I'm not even counting all the time that you will use to drive from here, get to the airport, do all the checking and all the things that are involved before the main flight. I'm not counting all that time. So just know that at least more than 24 hours of my day is, in fact, from tomorrow, from 12 o'clock tomorrow, is going to be go, 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 go till 12 something the upper day. But anyway, yeah, so me and my kids, we are all entitled to one hand luggage and one carry-on bag okay so our hand luggage is supposed to be like a box they have dimensions for what the box is supposed to be like but you guys know what hand luggage boxes are usually like they're usually the smallest of a set if you have a set now let me show you guys what we are actually carrying <laughs> because what you're entitled to is one thing but what you can actually manage is another thing and you guys know that i'm traveling with my kids alone i'm not going my husband's already there so i'm not even trying to make my life difficult okay in fact i've even done more than my husband was telling me to do because left for him i should just carry my set of three boxes and that's it but i couldn't just do that how can i leave almost how many kg just on the ground but anyway you guys know all that gist if you've been following this whole series yeah so for miss sophia this is what she's going to be carrying actually i didn't even want her to carry anything but because her sisters were carrying she wanted her own bag so i decided to just give her this small bag so inside this bag let me show you guys what is here she has this small purse that has pens and pencils one pencil then she has a whiteboard marker and the whiteboard eraser i have a whiteboard for her but it's inside cora's bag because it's big okay so that's what she has in here then she has two ribina <laughs> she has this small toy then she actually has some more pens here where did sophia get all these pens from i'm very very sure she's the one that came and put these pens inside her bag because sophia is obsessed with pens like low-key hiking she has an eraser she has a sharpener she has two four lollipops the reason why i bought these lollipops is because of their ears so what i'll do because normally i even do this when we travel what i'll do is that when once we enter the plane and we're about to take off i'll give them one lollipop to lick once we take off and you know that ear popping thing has stopped i'll collect it from them and trash it okay because i don't like them having lollipops to be honest then when we're about to land the same thing okay thank god i actually feel that thing so once i start feeling it, once i know that i'll start feeling it i'll just give them their lollipops so i actually bought this key holder that has her initials on it but auntie has already spoiled it so this is ava's bag you can see her key holder so inside her bag she has her own snack i think i also put Sophia's snack here, two packs of Ribena, biscuits, she has this, even though I put it for her, like they are all sharing, it's not like one person for one biscuit, I bet it'd be a party, are you here for party? Um, then her lollipop, why is her lollipop just two? She has, is this, it's for writing, it's just to keep them busy anyway, I was the one that knitted, because the pen did not have this key holder, so I knitted this, I just used knitting thread to make it, to keep the pen, so you can use it to write, so this is basically for Ava and Sophia, like they can just interchange anytime that they want because they are carrying their tabs as well. But this one is just for, you know, once bored on setting, just say, mommy, I'm bored, take this one. Mommy, I'm bored, take that one. That's what I'm just going to be doing. Exercise book. So she has two exercise books. One is for Sophia, one is for Ava. So let them just draw and write and color and do whatever they like with it, okay? That's why I bought, they're actually brand new exercise books. I'm like, if you're bored, bring it out and start drawing, bring it out and start writing, start making cards, whatever it is that you can do, don't disturb me. She has a pen, she has a pencil, and she also has a ruler, and she's also now going to be dragging one hand luggage. Now, I tried not want to give her a hand luggage before, but my gadgets are too many, and I cannot check in, you know, my gadgets, especially my batteries and stuff, I can't check them in, so that is why I had to 
use one of the bags to put my gadgets then i don't want to carry a backpack because anyway the last time i carried a backpack to travel i felt it my shoulders it was just uncomfortable for me and the backpack because my laptop is inside is uncomfortable so this time i decided to put my backpack inside one another hand luggage okay so the two hand luggages that we should have carried my things are inside so i now brought this extra one to put the kids things this is um, sophia's school bag and I'm, I'm also using this to just check and make sure there's nothing inside this bag i don't want when we get the time to check in you just find one thing now that nobody asks them to put because someone like eva eva is a collector sometimes she can go there now and go and put one thing now that will put you in trouble i don't want anybody to stop me anywhere i don't want any liquid or anything that will make them stop me because with three children nah the number one thing that i have is this antibacterial wipes you guys i don't think i can survive without antibacterial wipes because if you guys have daughters you know that when they want to pee in fact it's so bad for me that anytime that my kids tell me they want to pee here my heart skips because you guys know how toilets can be so messy and kids have to sit down to pee even though we've taught them how not to sit like they kind of hang to pee but at the same time their lap still touch the toilet bowl somehow so i make sure i have antibacterial wipes um, I was looking for Clorox actually, but I didn't see Clorox. So I saw this one and decided to just buy it. And it looks it looks good. It looks like it works. I don't know what stress can do. I don't know what will happen with my, with my system. I don't want to be caught unawares, okay, or caught on fresh. So that is why I have this pad in my bag as well. Now, the reason why I have this is because of my kids. When they pee and all that, I, I want to use wipes for them instead of tissue. Because tissue can irritate that area. I don't want anybody to gets to their, their destination with itchy bum bum or whatever okay so when they pee we'll use these wipes when they wash when we want to clean their face or clean anything from their skin or you know just or just freshen up we'll use these wipes okay so that is why i bought water wipes and i'm going to keep it here so my kids braid their hair i don't want them to be uncomfortable in the plane so once we enter the plane and settle down i'll give everybody their hair bonnets to cover their hair just so that they are comfortable okay so i'm also carrying this plantain chips it's just extra snack to have that is why i'm carrying it so inside this bag this is like a toiletry bag inside this bag i have a bunch of random things once we enter the plane you know we're going to check in all these bags i'm going to put them in the overhead luggage right this one is not going into the overhead luggage this one is going to be with me throughout the flight i'm just i'm just going to put some essentials inside it okay so I have some earplugs and stuff from the different flights, but I don't know if I'll need them. And I also have dental floss here, in case, just in case. Then I have Vaseline lip therapy, just to use and freshen our lips so we don't have dry lips. Um, I actually need it now. <laughs> um, then I have this, I don't know what these things are. I went to pharmacy, no, I, I know what they are actually. These are like strep seals, not strep, these are Lozan, Lozan. So, lozenges <laughs> I say Los Angeles. so yeah these are lozenges these are for if you're having sore throat or cough or whatever but i don't pray for that i've just been praying nobody no sickness no no nothing okay but still i just have to at least have some on hand just in case in here i have a very small bottle of perfume when we want to freshen up we'll use it to freshen up i also have my own lip gloss here um this is just a lip gloss this is oil bath oil i don't even know why i took this oil bath oil just in case i think this thing is eucalyptus oil i don't even know what exactly is oil bath oil i think it's eucalyptus let me see these are toilet seat covers i've had them for a long time actually so yeah these are disposable toilet seat covers i bought this for 600 naira and it is 10 pieces inside it so anytime my kids want to poo okay because when they want to pee there's a way I hold them up, like we, they don't sit on the toilet, I hold them up somehow and they pee, okay? Then they clean up and everything. But if they want to pull, I can't hold them up like that to pull. So if they want to pull, I will use I have um ventilated spirits here, but I want to pour it inside small, small bottles so I don't look at the spirit. Let me just show you guys. So I have the spirits here. I tried to look for sanitizer, I didn't I couldn't find. I was seeing expired sanitizer and I'm like does it make it more effective or less effective if, if it is if it is expired but i think it's less effective if it is, if it is expired <sighs> yes anyway so i just bought rubbing alcohol actually i had this one in the house so i want to pour this into small small containers so when they want to pull i'll use the alcohol first spray it on this seat clean the seats very well then put this seat cover on top of it 
you know then when they finish pouring you know dispose of the seat cover and flush and all of that okay clean them up so that's why i have this but i don't have it inside the bag yet because this quantity is too much this 200 ml they're definitely going to collect it at the airport so i want to pour it into small small containers but this toilet seat covers they are the dream okay they are the dream if you have girls if you have boys if anybody said because i don't even care whether you are male or female it's gross to sit on on public toilet seats it's very very gross i also have rob yes you guys know rob now just to to try and help with cold then i now have paracetamol for the kids so i'm carrying paracetamol just in case anybody starts experiencing fever i'll give them paracetamol i don't pray for that like i'm just praying against any any way 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 any health issues any wahala i don't i'm just praying against it i think that's all i have here i'll still put my own paracetamol in here because sometimes i used to feel headache and wife flying i'll still put my own paracetamol in here and i also have these hair ties i don't know where the other two are these hair ties are just to pack their hair before we now put them inside the bonnet because yeah anyway i don't know where the other two are but whatever final things i'm going to be putting in here is toothbrushes and toothpaste we're all using our toothbrush and toothpaste now and i don't want to start putting new ones in here so before we finally leave i'm going to carry all their toothbrushes and their toothpaste including mine and put in here so that when we get to doha we can all brush our teeth and just freshen up and get ready for the next leg of our journey. Cora, <laughs> so this bag is heavy. This bag is heavy, and maybe I'll remove some things and put somewhere else. This bag is heavy, even though Cora told me it's not heavy. She carried it, so it's not heavy now. Look at it now, it's not heavy. I was like, Cora, excitement now will let you will make you say it's not heavy. When we start walking now, my new wakata ya, you might tell me it's heavy, but anyway. So here we have some extra biscuits. Okay, I have too many biscuits here. I have this. I have this and I have this. That's that's too many. Nope, 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 nope. That's too many. <laughs> now biscuits on a good chop. That's too many. Um Cora also has her own notebook for you know writing and just keeping herself busy. Then she also has this not this one not necessarily for her. This is for everybody. This is an activity book. I bought this in Canada. It's an activity book that they can just be doing in the plane. They will just take turns. Maybe you do one page, you give your sister, your sister will do another page. They just take turns. This is another activity book. I bought this one in Nigeria. I love this book so much. It has a lot of activities like Okpo, Okpo, Okpo. But it's Disney princesses. That's why I like it. But it has. Wait, let me let me adjust this light. This is my light. I'll go adjust tire. Mm -hmm. So it has a lot of activities to do. Like. A lot, a lot. Are you seeing this? Yeah, this was from Big, so I'm packing it for her. The reason why I'm not banking on tabs is that there are, there's no data. There's no, I don't know. I don't know if they'll give us Wi Fi on the plane, but even if they, they, they do, I don't know how strong it's going to be. So I don't want to rely on their tab tablets. Using natural light is just torture. Like I've been changing this lighting up and down, up and down. Anyway, so she has her four lollipops, then she has this. Um, pencil case she also has her pen this is an erasable pen then she has her normal pencil to so freshen your breath is why i have gums another thing is to prevent your ears from popping okay so you can either take lollipop or you can chew gum i don't like lollipop so i'll most likely chew gum but anybody that wants gum i'll give them okay that's a, I, I, I don't give my children gum to chew but in that plane anything you want take it <laughs> that's why i am bringing all my like anything you want that will just not stress me just take it because johnny will be here and i'm not about to come and start regretting my life so the next bag here is going to be this is technically sophia's hand luggage technically but she's not going to carry it i'm just going to it, it's this youtube bag so i'm going to put it inside one of my hand luggages like this so i'm the one carrying the two basically okay so but it's technically sophia's hand luggage um so in here we just have i don't want to show you guys now because i don't want to open this bag but in here we have all our winter jackets socks head warmer gloves panties um what else did i put here yeah that's all you guys will see it on the journey like just just be subscribed to my channel okay subscribe to my channel and you'll see all these things but yeah so anyway i can bring out some so this is like some head warmers, this is Corazon, these are all panties, 
I don't even know why I packed this many panties in here, but I just just in case, like just in case anybody needs to change pants or change socks or change anything, we have it in here. So these are more head warmers. These are gloves. Um, if you want to see us wearing them, please subscribe to the channel. This is another head warmer. The funny part is that I don't actually have a head warmer. Me myself, I don't think I have. I didn't buy for myself, to be honest. Which is which is funny. I bought them all in Canada. Um, yeah, I think I bought them at Walmart. Then these winter jackets are the ones I bought at Once Upon a Child. That reminds me, somebody came to my comment section and said, how can I leave Nigeria and go to Canada and be buying thrift? Come on, get out. I need a query. Come on, go and sit down. You think say you get sense? You think say you wise? Hmm? If it's paying you, carry money and send to me now. Has anybody have I ever come here to say please? Nobody should send me money. I have too much. Has anybody done? Have I have ever done that? If you can, if you see me thrifting things and you feel like it's beneath me or it's beneath anybody or I shouldn't be doing that, buy me money one time. You go see me. I go enter Balenciaga. If that's what you want, I go enter Balenciaga, I go buy brand new winter jacket of 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 uh, 2024 uh, 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 winter winter fashion. Now the next bag, you guys, <laughs> I'm even tired of showing you. Now the next bag is this bag. Um, this is one of my. This is the smallest of a set of boxes that I have. So in here, right? In here is actually just basically my backpack. Can you see this? It's basically, I think I have some things here. Some of my gadgets things are in here. But the bag is basically full of my backpack. Like I said, I don't want to carry backpack, you guys. Like, I don't want to. I want to. I'd rather drag my look, my luggage. And these boxes are so nice. They're the type that have four wheels that can rotate. So they're easy to drag along. That carrying on my shoulder, please, was painful the last time. I, I had shoulder pains for a long time. So I just told myself, well, why am I suffering like this? Because I want to carry extra load. I just used the one bag for for it so my laptop is going to be in here this particular bag so my laptop and the most valuables are going to be in here then the last thing to show you guys which i am so excited about is this bag so you guys this is going to be my backpack in quotes my carry-on bag this is it i'm not carrying <laughs> this reminds me of una bros bags okay <laughs> the people i call una bros are basically these rich Igbo men rich Igbo businessmen who can wear palm slippers, carry this kind of bag, and be jumping bike. Meanwhile, they are controlling billions. Like men like that. That's what I, that's what I call Una Bros. So this was like Una Bros bag, eh? but now I understand why they carry bags like this. I bought this bag on AliExpress. Okay, I bought it on AliExpress. I can't remember how much I bought it, but I bought it on AliExpress. When this came, I was even looking at it like mm, this is not what I thought to. I don't. I'm not really sure about this bag, but let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. This bag carries a lot. Okay, when I say carries a lot, it carries a whole lot. So here, I have my Lebara card. They gave me this card. This is my SIM card. They gave it to me when we apply for the US UK visa. They gave me this Lebara card. So uh, SIM card. So I just have it in here. When I get there, I'm going to just put it into my phone actually i won't just put it here now so these are a hundred pounds in cash so i got smaller denominations 10 10 pounds and 20 20 pounds it was actually nello that helped me to withdraw this when she traveled um to the uk for vacation so she helped me to withdraw some my husband took some um this just basically just in case the money is just for just in case like i don't really have any use for it per se but just in case let me just have, have cash on me because i also have my bank card as well my dollar card which i normally use at the airport i normally use my dollar card to buy stuff at the airport and whatever but just in case your card is speaking english and you need something that's why i have this dollar actually i mean i had this pound i actually had dollars i went to go and sell my dollars and now i'm like i should have just kept some because i had like 20 dollars and then 100 hundred dollars I just kept the twenty dollars because just in case you don't know whether they'll tell you they prefer to, I don't know Sha, but anyway, this one is enough. Then I have our passport. I also have some Naira. This is to spend at the airport. This is two two hundred Naira. I want to use this money to pay for stuff at the airport, like to buy, to pay for trolleys and stuff like that. I have some small small documents here that I took from the house. Then in here. I have all my kids' immunization 
papers okay including my own immunization papers so i have my yellow card here i have my covid vaccine card here then all my kids immunization documents are all in here okay and then now i have my cards um I have my driver's license because I actually renewed my driver's license. So this one is actually expiring in 2028. So I have my driver's license here. I have my um, dollar card in here. Uh, then I have passport in here. So that's it. That's all I have in here. And trust me, there is still so much space in this bag. There's a zip here. There are three zips in front. There's a big zip here with a smaller zip inside and pockets and pockets like this bag. Just go and look at it on. If I have a link, I'll put it in my description box if I remember. But just go and look at it on. There's even a pocket here and a pocket here. This thing carry can, this thing can carry a lot, but I'm not stuffing it because I can carry a lot and I'll stuff it too much. No, I just put the main, main, main valuables here. So I'm going to carry it like this. I'm going to be in front of me. I don't know if you guys can see. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so that is how I am going to carry it in front of me, like an inner bros, and travel. Okay, but yeah, that's it. That is all I'm carrying as our hand luggage. Basically, everybody has a bag and a hand luggage, but technically, some bags are just for fancy, like Sophia's bag is just for fancy, and her hand luggage, I'm the one carrying it. Eva will carry um, the backpack I showed you. Wakura will carry my second luggage that has, that you can, dr that you can drag. So basically, we're all set to go. I'm really excited, I can't wait. Cora woke up this morning and told me, one day to go and I was like, yes, <laughs> one day to go. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I hope you learned something. I don't know. I hope you saw something and felt, oh yeah, maybe I should get that too for my own trip. But anyway, I'll tell you guys when I get there, how it went with all these things. Because it's one thing in theory to be thinking, we'll freshen up, we'll clean up, we'll put this, we'll use that. It's one thing in theory to be thinking that is another thing to actually put it to practice or actually use it okay so when i get there i'll let you guys know if all these things were are helpful and if there are any things that i wish i had carried as well i'll let you guys know because i know that some um, things that i know i didn't think of when i now get there you know you don't know what you don't know when i now get another like oh if i know i've carried this thing anyway i'll let you guys know as well but thank you guys so much for watching if you stay to the end of this video you're the real mvp i love you so much okay please subscribe if you're not subscribed and i'll see you all in my next video bye guys